Hey fellow agents, this is Agent Smith and we are playing King's Quest 7. So, we're back in this little portal area where the, where the horse dropped us off originally and it looks like each one of these goes to different places. So, I'm going to start here and I'm also thinking that this Ambrosia, similar to Nectar, are foods and drinks of the gods. So, hopefully, this will take us to the fort. Yes, this is exactly where I was hoping it would take us. I'm going to drop this Ambrosia in here because this is something else for them, I believe. Or maybe it's for this one. Yeah. A cornucopia. She pours the nectar and he grows this one grows the foods. So that makes sense. Let's see what this provides for us. Ooh. Fancy fruits. Oh I got a pomegranate. Ah. Oh. I wonder. So, in Greek mythology, the pomegranate seeds are what allow um, people to uh, leave. I do believe uh, the um, Hades' wife uh, can come back and forth. It's the reason why we have seasons. When she leaves, our land gets dark and cold. It's the winter and the fall, the spring and summer when she arrives back. But she uses pomegranate to do that. So I'm thinking this is what I need for it. To heal her. Hello, Lord Attis. Hello, Valenice. My lady and I wait for the fire from the heavens. Perhaps our fates will be happier in the next world. Hmm. Well, how about some of this? I have replenished the cornucopia, Lord Attis. See, this strange fruit was part of its bounty. A pomegranate? The pomegranate is the symbol of birth and death, that, of regeneration. That. Perhaps it could help my series. But no, I dream. Why not? Try it. If you aren't going to do it, I will. Oh, there you go. Squish your ribcage. My love, my love. Sweet husband, how I missed you. I cannot stay, Ceres. I must go to Etheria and do what I can to help. The volcano. I know, love. I have work to be done as well. The forest has sustained much damage from Alicia's ugly curse, and I must make it right. Oh. <laughs> All right. Well, that resolves that issue. You have my deepest thanks, dear lady. No problem. You are very welcome, Lady Ceres. Farewell, my friend. You gonna give me something for all that work? No, nope, just gonna walk off into the woods and start making trees good again. All right, plants grow and beauty everywhere. Look at that. Look at all that. Begin with this whole entire field. That's cool. Can I take any of these? No. Okay. Can't bother her either. Alright, let's fight our way out back to the, um, the the portals and see if there's another way we can go. I need to go and talk to the only other humans I can think of that I would make sense for me to go to. Would probably be over to the Ogre Booga Land and talk to the mortician if he's back from his thing. Let's try this one and see where this one goes. He might have something that could help us with this whole situation. Close enough. Hi, sugar pie. Yeah, yeah, fuck you. Leave me alone. Hey there, mama. <laughs> I didn't think I'd ever see your succulent self again. Most people never come out of that bad old Ooga Booga land. Why don't you come on over here and tell me about it? Oh. <clears throat> no thanks. I'll just keep my distance from you guys. Oh, 
those fucking kids, man. Pretty ready for the end of the world, they are. Excited. Good, he's back. All right, let's go talk to the doctor. I just figured that would be the case. They have him away from me long enough because he's. I probably came in and spoke to him way too early. But that's all right. Now that he's back, he might be able to help us with our My newfound dear situation. My lady Valenice, what brings you back to this neck of the boneyard? Dr. Cadaver, I have a, a terrible problem. Mm -hmm. Come in, come in. Anybody see her come in? No, they didn't. <laughs> How can I help you, Lady Valenice? I'll take some of those. It's a long story, Doctor. But what it comes down to is that I must travel to Dreamland to see Lady Mab. But I can't find a safe place to sleep. Yes, coffin. Be Is good. that all? Don't worry, my lady. Just climb into my coffin here. It's lined with pure dream silk. Ooh. You'll be asleep in no time. Sounds like a plan. Thank sleep? you. Sleep? In the coffin? Yeah. Try it, my dear. I slip into the coffin for a quick nap between patients myself sometimes. It's probably the best sleep you'll ever get. Comfy. What's this? Why the box of spare parts? As you probably know, my lady, the volcano is about to erupt. I am expecting a lot of damage in Ooga Booga, so I stocked up on arms and legs and such. Smart. Pre-planning. Do you promise you, you won't close the lid while I'm in the coffin? Of course. I won't bury you either. Oh. Well, well, with that assurances. Thank you. He's like, this is my bed. Why would I do that? All right, fine. Let's go sleep. Sleep in the coffin. I suppose I could try to sleep here. Please do. I'll make sure you're not disturbed. Thank you. <laughs> Here you are, my dear. Sweet dreams. Okay. Oh, we are balls tripping, aren't we? What the heck is that? Right into the ocean. A dream sea. You don't think she could swim at all with that dress on. I think it would just drag her down. They must have enjoyed being able to do this. Just do whatever crazy shit they wanted to. I thought that was a hole in the clouds. <coughs> nope, that's who I'm looking for. I think it's who I'm looking for. My lady, are you all right? I went to Dreamland, and Mab, uh, she was frozen. She was a solid block of ice. Hmm. Oh dear, Mab was never known for her warm personality. But that doesn't sound right at all. No. I thought that was what was supposed to be happening, but apparently like not. looks like things are worse than we knew. I must go. Thank you, Dr. Cadaver. You've been very kind. Okay, we gotta get back to the fates then and see what they're gonna say for us. I wish you the best of luck, Lady Valenice. Farewell! Yes, I'll probably be back for information from you again. Oh, no, you're out again. Never mind. What do you do when you're out? Alright, let's get back. I'm gonna get back to the fates and I'll see you there.
And away to the fates we go. I have seen Mab, and she has been frozen into a lifeless statue of ice. Which means you got to find me another way. in the spring, mortal. Perhaps the Lady of Spring can tell you what may be done. She of the flower. That would make sense. She of the forest. <clears throat> All right. Thank you for that information. Off to Ceres. All right. Ceres, we need your help. How do you thaw a frozen woman? Lady Ceres, may I ask a question of you? Series. Anything. <clears throat> I have seen Mab, Lady of Dreams, and she has been placed under a terrible curse. She's been frozen like a block of ice. Lady of Spring, what can be done for her? Frozen, you say? Let me think. I do recall a legend, yes. You must fill a shaft of crystal with purest sunlight. With that you can thaw her. But I must warn you, you cannot take any physical objects into the land of dreams while you are asleep, my lady. You will have to travel there awake. Hmm. Okay. Let's travel to Militia's house, because I believe I've seen a bunch of crystals in her place. I know i also seen a bunch in the dragon's place, but it seemed to be only diamonds, so they're not what I'm looking for. But, you know what? This one might be a little bit short, but before I break into Malicious Place again, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and end this one here. And the next, we'll be working on trying to get a hold of her stuff, the crystals to wake up the dream the uh, goddess. And hopefully, that'll be the things that we need that'll help us stop this volcano from going. So, if you guys are enjoying this, um, don't forget to hit that notification bell. I don't know what else to tell you guys. I'm trying to find a better way to end these things, so... Hope you guys enjoyed this, and if you did, I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day. Hey, fellow Asians, don't forget to like and subscribe by clicking the button in the center of the screen. You can also find the last video by clicking the button to the left, and you can take a look at some of the other stuff I've done by clicking the button to the right. Hope you enjoyed the video, and have a good day.